English Impact is day 108. Asteroid, A-S-T-E-R-O-I-D. It's the first option. Number two, classic, does not have a K, C-L-A-S-S-I-C. Number three, punctual, means always on time, P-U-N-C-T-U-A-L. Number four, uh, sh sound, shadow, S-H. C-H for chef, C-I for, for musician, and T-I for station. Number five, glorious and various. Again, we change the Y to I and add O-U-S. So G-L-O or I-O-U-S, V-A or I-O-U-S. Number six, clippers, hair clippers, for example. Maybe some of you are, are cutting your hair or your parents are cutting your hair with the hair clippers. Um, or um, men sometimes use clippers to shave their beard. So if they don't want to shave it all the way, they want to leave a bit of hair, they can use hair clippers. Um, they're always plural. Number seven, poverty has more syllables. Number eight, muscle would be the last Q or yeah, muscle would be the last in alphabetical order. Number nine, munch means to chew noisily. Mm -mm. He munched on the biscuits. Number 10, I tied a ribbon in a big bow, B-O-W, on the bow of the tree, B-O-U-G-H. Number 11, I chose the brightest ribbon in the shop. Number 12, my friend will find. Will find is the verb group, will find. Number 13, the adjectives here are both colors, pink and blue. Pink is for the ribbon and blue describes the spots. Um, number 14, looked is the verb. And number 15, at the beginning, before here, we open the speech marks and we close them after the second exclamation mark, after I've got it. She cried. Okay, so she cried is not in the speech marks.